I'm Sandra Chow. I'm a Google certified innovator and trader from Toronto, Canada, but currently living in Beijing, China. I'm going to answer, how can I use digital storytelling with my classes, which relates to communication in Google Classroom. Since the dawn of humanity, people have engaged in storytelling. Storytelling allows for people to connect with each other, share about life, convey ideas, and to be creative. While storytelling in the past may have been restricted to being in oral or print form, nowadays we have a myriad of tools that allow us to share our stories in digital formats as well. Through digital storytelling, students can easily share their stories online and add multimedia elements like images, videos, and text in creative ways, thus opening up doors for our students to powerfully tell their stories to a wider audience and let their voices be heard. You can create digital storytelling assignments in Classroom like any other assignment. Begin by creating an assignment. You might decide to have students create their own individual story or write collaboratively on a story together. Attach an example of a story for st your students as a model. Assign a due date and a rubric so that students have an understanding of what is expected. Our first digital storytelling idea utilizes Google Drawings to tell a six-word story. It is fabled that Ernest Hemingway wrote the first six-word story when challenged at a luncheon to write a short story that was only six words long. This was his story, for sale, baby shoes, never worn. While Ernest Hemingway shared his story orally in words, our students can more powerfully express their ideas digitally in a six-word story by simply selecting appropriate font and adding images to their story. In this way, students are also learning media design skills. To create their story, students will add or create a Google Drawings in their assignment. They use the text box feature to type their six words, introduce the use of font and more fonts to help students select a font that will match the tone or mood of the story that they have written. Fonts can add to and emphasize the message of their stories. For example, you can convey the feeling of shock or surprise using bold fonts or create an eerie feeling with a fun and spooky font. The size of their font will also affect the tone or mood of the storytelling. Next, students will add an image by using their insert image tool. Search the web by typing an appropriate keyword. They'll want to select their image carefully so that the image enhances their storytelling, matching with the tone or mood of the story. They can also use the format options tool to adjust the color or make adjustments to the image for effect. Our second digital storytelling idea is very similar to the first, but this time, instead of using Google Drawings, which is only one large space for creation, we will use Google Slides to create a picture book. Google Slides allows for multiple pages and opportunities for including audio, video, and hyperlinks between slides. This creates an even more dynamic digital storytelling experiences for students. To create their story, students will add or create a Google Slides in their assignment. They will be able to use the text box and insert image tool just like in Google Drawings. In addition, students will be able to add to slides to create multiple pages to their story. Students can also create animations or add hyperlinks on the slides to create an interactive effect. Add images or objects that move or fade away when clicked using the animate feature so that students can add a fun element to their story. Using hyperlinks, students can create branches that allow for digital choose your own adventure stories. In this way, students can create interesting stories that allow their readers to choose the pathway they want to follow. Now we know two fun and creative ways to use digital storytelling with your classes. Google Drawings to tell six word stories and Google Slides to create interactive picture books. Thanks for watching and happy storytelling.